What's going on guys, Michael here, and today I have an unboxing and a first impression video of the Halo Band. This is actually a health and wellness band from Amazon. If you missed my Echo Loop video, a commenter on there said that they wanted to see a review of this, and I got an invitation to purchase it, so I want to do a quick unboxing here, first impressions, and get a general look of it. Uh, it is $65 right now. It's at the invite price point right now, actually. If you do want to purchase one of these, I will leave a link in the description down below where you can either sign up to request an invite, or hopefully if you're watching this video, maybe it's already out and you can just purchase it. But $65 right now for the invite period. It's going to be 100 bucks when it launches. All right, so here's a closer look at the box. You can see on top here, I did get the black version. They also have a pink and a white or gray version. It does come in small, medium, and large. They do have sizing kits available on the actual website to help size it. So let's go ahead and open some of this up and see what's inside. And let's open it up. And there, right when you open it up, you can see the actual band itself. So taking that out of the box, you can see, uh, this is actually kind of interesting here. You can see that's the actual device there. So that's gonna be what's on your wrist, kind of tracking everything. Let's see what else we get inside the box though. Set all this off to the side. It looks like we get some literature here, so we'll see exactly what this all is. So you get to uh, quote unquote meet your halo band. It looks like you got the picture of the actual fabric band as well as the sensor there. Uh, and then you're gonna get a USB charging clip or cradle I guess in this. Uh, moving over just so a little bit more about first things to do to get set up. They do have like a tone feature on this so it can actually track the tone of your voice and tell you if you're anxious or if you're depressed or if you sound bored when you're talking throughout the day. That'll be an interesting feature to try out. Uh, more about the actual mic itself. So you can, of course, mute and unmute this. Privacy is a big concern with this, especially being a big corporation like Amazon. Let's see what else we get inside the box here. But here it looks to be the actual charger, and it's just a USB connection here. Hello, kitty. You have helping me film a video? That's great. Yeah, great angle. All right, so here's a closer look at the actual charging clip here. This is literally like a clip. Uh, so we're going to put the actual device on it here. We have it plugged into a power source. And is that it? I'm not sure. Did I put it on right? There we go. So you can see the light is pairing there, blinking white. So now you can go over and pair it to Amazon's Echo app. All right, correction here. So because this does not have Alexa built into it, I apologize if you have Echoes and your Echoes are going off right now, but this does not have Alexa built into it. So you're actually gonna need to download a new app. It's not gonna be able to set up on Alexa here. So let's go ahead and download the new Amazon Halo app. All right, here we go. So we can see the Halo app there, and let's let's download it. So let's open it up and set it up. So we'll set up the band here, and it's gonna want me to sign in with my Amazon account. So this is basically just asking a ton of personal information right now. It asked me what my name was, what my weight was, it asked me what my height was. Uh, so we're just setting all that up right now. Now it wants me to plug it into the charger, and it's gonna set up everything. So let's do that. Hopefully we're good now. Now that we have the app downloaded, and there it is. And then this tells you that you get that Halo membership free for six months, otherwise $3.99 afterwards. And let's go ahead and update this. So, looks like we're having a little bit of an issue here, so I'm going to try to troubleshoot this. Alright, so I'm editing this video now, and at this point in the setup process, it took about 30 minutes to actually set this up. There was a lot of troubleshooting I had to do. I had to disconnect the Bluetooth from my iPhone. I had to factory reset this thing quite a few times. Overall, it just wasn't a fun experience setting up. In fact, if you go back a little bit in the video, you can see the time on the top left corner of my iPhone compared to the time in the next clip. It just took way, way too long. But I've been wearing this thing for about a little, a little under 24 hours now and I'm liking it so far, but this setup process was a pain. Let's continue with the video though. We finally got this paired. This took way too long to do. Not great first impressions, but let's keep going here. So it asked me if I wanted notifications. I said, yes, I'm gonna keep notifications on for now. I'm actually gonna be wearing this on my right hand since I have the Apple Watch on the left. And this also does give you some tips here. So you want the button facing you and then you want to slide the band just above your wrist bone, so the band is about two fingers width from your wrist, and then you want to tighten it until snug. And I think it is, uh, I think it's on correctly there. You can see it's kind of a stretchy fabric here, uh, just this the standard band you get, and that's on pretty tough, pretty snug. So, let's continue. We're finishing setup. Hopefully there's no more issues. There we go. All right, so we're finally done. We got it set up after a lot of troubleshooting. First impressions, I'm excited to use this thing. I really am. 
I think it's a really good entry point. 65 bucks for the invitation period, 100 bucks when it goes retail. Not super excited about the $4 monthly subscription thing though. I don't know how long I'll use that. But first impressions, the setup sucked. I did not, uh, I did not enjoy that. Troubleshooting it for, I don't know, 15, 30 minutes was not fun. I've actually had that issue with Amazon devices before. If you missed my Echo Loop video, you should check that out because I actually had some pairing issues with that as well. I'll leave a link at the end of this video to that. Let me know in the comments down below if you're interested in the Halo device from Amazon. If you are going to get one, leave a comment down below. If you're interested in it, the product link is in the description. I'll have a review of this eventually after I try it for a few days here. If you like the video, please consider giving it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, I'm constantly putting out new technology videos. So consider subscribing. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll talk to you in the next one.